Hello space fans and welcome to Your Sky Tonight for July 21st, 2017. My name is Tony Darnell from Deep Astronomy Out Space. And tonight we're going to be looking out in our night sky at about 9.30 this evening Eastern Time in the Northern Hemisphere. And tonight what I want you to do is turn from the south, looking south, to going to looking due east. This is the direction exact, directly opposite of where the um, sun has set. And I want you to look about halfway up the night sky from overhead. And what you'll see, what you should see, are three very bright stars that make up what's called an asterism. And I told you about asterisms when I discussed the Big Dipper. But an asterism is just a fancy word that means group or pattern of stars. And the the summer triangle is one such asterism. It's very visible tonight. And if you go out about 9.30, you'll see these very three bright stars that are all part of different constellations. The three stars that I want to focus on are Deneb, which is in the constellation of Cygnus the Swan. It's the 19th most brightest star in our night sky. It's a blue supergiant, and it is actually larger than Rigel which is uh, in the constellation of Orion. Also making up the Summer Triangle is a star called Altair. It is uh, the 12th brightest star in our sky, and it's an A-type main sequence star. It's 16 and a half light years away. Deneb is uh, over 3,500 light years away. But the star I want to focus on tonight is a star known as Vega. And Vega is in the constellation of Lyra, the harp. And it's one of the most interesting stars in our night sky. 12,000 years ago, this was our North Star. What many people don't realize is that at the, as the Earth turns on its axis every single day, it also wobbles like a top. And 12,000 years ago, the axis of that top, which is the North Pole of the Earth, was pointing here to Vega. Right now, it's pointing to nor near the star Polaris in the Little Dipper. But 12,000 years ago, this is where it pointed. This was our North Star. And uh, it's the fifth brightest star in the sky, which is uh, because it's a, uh, blue t it's a blue main sequence type star. And it's about one-tenth the age of the sun, but it's two and a half times more massive. So this is a... This is an extremely important star. In fact, it's been, it's been called the second most important star in the sky after the sun. This was the first star to ever be photographed. It was also the first star to ever have its spectra taken. So this star, in addition to its brightness, has been very important astronomically. So when you go out at night, if you, when you can, try and look and find the, the three bright stars that make up the summer triangle and know that once one of them was our North Star. Well, that's it for tonight, space fans. Thank you all for listening. And as always, keep looking up.